Well, farming is about a phenomenon that uh, happened in England uh, after the Second World War, whereby African immigrants coming to Britain would farm or foster their child or children out to white working class families in order so they could work, study and save. The story follows the journey of a young boy named Enoton, which is based upon my own life, played by Damson <laughs> Idris, uh, <laughs> who, who is farmed uh, to a white working class couple, uh, played by Kate Beckinsale, who's uh, the, the wonderful complex mother in this. And uh, we, we follow his journey, how he grows up during that process, and um, you know, tries to find his identity in a world that uh, he doesn't belong. I was in a dark place throughout this movie. I kind of intentionally tormented myself and looked in the mirror and called myself a coon, wog, and, and I encouraged the, the cast to be really mean to me as well. And at first, every little thing they did, they'd be really nice afterwards. Mm -hmm. They'd be like, oh, get on the ground, Nick Nog, and then they'll be like, I'm so sorry, Damson, are you okay? Mm -hmm. And then we kind of encouraged them to, you know, get that all out the window and just focus on the character and focus on the people they were playing. That really helped me. And it was very unique, I think, working with Adewale, I think because obviously it's his life story. And as you were saying the other day, you know, there is a respect there and there's a huge sense of responsibility um, to honor to honor that person. But um, but yeah, I mean I think this is also a period of British history that hasn't really been seen in film before, certainly not from this point of view. Casting my mother, my foster mother, um, who Kate Be Beckinsale plays, was um, an enormous task because it's such a complex character and um, I didn't want a caricature because where we were going to take her on her journey was uncomfortable and at times uncompromising and I needed the audience to not tap out and always, you know, go back and, and understand where she was coming from and so, you know, that's where I'd seen some of Kate's work in Contraband, in The Aviator, and the gravitas um, is what really struck me. You know, Kate was, for me, the obvious choice. Not for everybody, but she was always, she was always, for me, the obvious choice. It was wonderful because it, it, isn't some, it isn't a part that I've had a big history of playing characters like that. As he says, she's a working class woman. Um, we had quite a lot of fun making me look more like Adewale's mum than I naturally do in real life. And, uh, and it felt great that Addy had sort of responded to those qualities without kind of going, oh, but she looks like this, or this is what I'm used to seeing her as. And it was a very tender letter that he sent me that f made me feel a lot of responsibility. It's, it's playing his foster mother, and it was a, a complicated, ambivalent relationship, and I wanted to honor that. Too.